Huawei is challenging NVIDIA with a new chip for artificial intelligence, according to The Wall Street Journal. Huawei has reportedly told potential clients that the chip is comparable to NVIDIA's H100. The AI market has long been dominated by NVIDIA, but as the U.S.-China trade war escalated, the U.S. imposed export restrictions that blocked China's access to advanced technologies, including the highly sought-after NVIDIA AI chips. This left China's tech industry with a stark choice, innovate from within or risk falling behind in the global AI race. However, one company rose to the challenge, Huawei. Now, Huawei isn't just catching up, it's aiming to lead. The company is channeling the pressure of isolation into innovation, pushing boundaries that many thought were unreachable. But can Huawei's new AI chip truly break Nvidia's dominance and spearhead China's AI revolution? Or will Nvidia's lead prove too great to overcome? Chapter 1, A Chip Born From Adversity Huawei's journey in the AI chip industry began in 2018 with the release of the Ascend 310. This chip marked Huawei's ambitious entry into the AI race, designed for edge computing, and quickly gained attention for its balance of performance and efficiency. However, it was the Ascend 910, released just a year later, that truly shipped the industry. Touted as the world's most powerful AI processor, the Ascend 910 was a marvel of engineering, capable of delivering 256 teraflops for half-precision floating-point calculations. At the time of the Ascend 910's release, NVIDIA was a dominant player in the AI chip market with its V100 GPUs, which were widely used for deep learning and high-performance computing. The V100, based on the Volta architecture, offered up to 125 teraflops of half-precision floating-point performance, which was already impressive, but fell short compared to the Ascend 910's 256 teraflops. However, just as Huawei was beginning to carve out its space in the global AI chip market, the company was hit with a series of crippling sanctions from the United States. These sanctions, part of a broader effort to curb China's technological advancements, severely restricted Huawei's access to essential semiconductor technologies and materials. The impact was immediate and profound. Huawei, once a rising star in the AI industry, found itself cut off from critical supply chains and struggling to maintain its momentum. The Ascend 910, despite its impressive capabilities, could not reach its full potential in a market dominated by U.S. technologies. But Huawei is not a company to back down easily. Instead of retreating, they doubled down on their efforts to innovate within the constraints imposed upon them. This spirit of perseverance has culminated in the development of the Ascend 910C. Scheduled to begin shipping in October this year, the Ascend 910C is a product born from adversity, designed to compete head-on with NVIDIA's H100, which has become a benchmark in the industry since its release in 2022. Chapter 2, David vs. Goliath On paper, the Ascend 910C matches the computational power of NVIDIA's H100, and in some scenarios, it even outperforms its rival. This chip, built on advanced 7 nanometer technology, strikes an impressive balance between power and efficiency, making it well suited for a wide range of AI applications. Whether it's training massive AI models or executing complex algorithms in real time, the Ascend 910C is engineered to deliver performance that rivals the best in the industry. Huawei's journey to develop the Ascend 910C has been anything but straightforward. The company has had to navigate significant challenges, particularly those posed by U.S. sanctions, which have severely restricted its access to critical semiconductor technologies. These restrictions could have crippled lesser companies, but Huawei has responded by turning inward and fostering collaborations with domestic suppliers, such as Semiconductor Manufacturing International Corp., SMIC. The Ascend 910C has already caught the attention of major Chinese companies like Baidu, ByteDance, and China Mobile, who have tested the chip and shown considerable interest. Preliminary discussions suggest that Huawei could receive orders for over 70,000 units, potentially generating around $2 billion in revenue. Despite the production challenges imposed by the sanctions, Huawei remains determined to begin shipments by October. On the other side of the equation, NVIDIA is not resting on its laurels. 
The company is pushing forward with the development of the B20, a new AI chip specifically designed for the Chinese market. Although the B20 remains somewhat under wraps, it is expected to push the boundaries of AI processing even further. The chip is engineered to comply with current U.S. export controls while still offering substantial performance improvements, with some reports suggesting it could be 2.5 to 5 times faster in raw floating point precision than its predecessor, the H100. NVIDIA has also partnered with Inspur, a major distributor in China, to ensure a smooth launch and distribution of the B20, with shipments planned to begin in the second quarter of 2025. This move is part of NVIDIA's broader strategy to maintain its strong presence in China, a market that accounted for about 17% of the company's revenue in the last fiscal year. However, NVIDIA's path forward is not without its own challenges, as the U.S. is expected to continue tightening export controls related to semiconductors. The global tech landscape is increasingly being shaped by the fierce competition between the United States and China, with AI chips becoming a crucial front in this ongoing conflict. What started as a trade war focused on tariffs and trade deficits has now evolved into a broader struggle for technological dominance, with AI chips at the heart of this battle. Recognizing the strategic importance of semiconductors, the United States has imposed strict sanctions on Chinese tech companies, particularly Huawei, in a bid to hinder China's technological progress. These sanctions are not merely economic measures, they are strategic moves aimed at curbing China's rise as a global tech leader by restricting its access to cutting-edge technologies. One of the most significant blows to China's tech ambitions came with the ban on Huawei's access to advanced semiconductor technologies. Chapter 3, AI Chips as the New Battleground Taiwan Semiconductor Manufacturing Company, TSMC, the world's largest contract chipmaker and a critical supplier to many global tech giants, was forced to cease its business with Huawei due to U.S. pressure. TSMC's cutting-edge fabrication capabilities are essential for producing the most advanced AI chips, and losing access to this resource was a major setback for Huawei and other Chinese companies relying on foreign semiconductor technology. The U.S. also extended its crackdown by banning the export of AI chips to China, further tightening the noose around China's tech sector. These chips are vital for powering the sophisticated AI systems that are becoming central to everything from big data analysis to autonomous driving. By cutting off access to these critical components, the U.S. aims to slow down China's progress in AI, a field that is increasingly viewed as the next frontier of global technological leadership. The ripple effects of this technological race are significant, especially for China's tech ecosystem. The U.S. sanctions, intended to isolate Huawei and slow its progress, have inadvertently sparked a shift within China's tech industry. Companies like ByteDance, the creator of TikTok, which once relied heavily on foreign technologies, are now exploring and adopting domestic alternatives like Huawei's Ascend 910C. This shift isn't just about survival, it marks a broader transformation within the Chinese tech sector. As more Chinese firms turn to homegrown technologies, the market dynamics are beginning to shift in meaningful ways. AI chips are essential because they drive the computational power needed for advanced AI applications, from machine learning to autonomous systems. The ability to design and produce these chips is now seen as a key factor in national security and economic strength. While the U.S. currently holds a significant advantage in advanced semiconductor design, China is rapidly catching up, investing heavily in its semiconductor industry, and developing its own AI chips. This race for supremacy in AI technology is reshaping the global tech landscape, with far-reaching implications for both nations. The struggle over AI chips is not just about technological capabilities, it is about defining the future balance of power on the global stage. As Huawei pushes forward, the world watches closely, knowing that the outcome of this technological rivalry will have profound implications for the global landscape. Will Huawei succeed in breaking Nvidia's dominance, or will the weight of international pressure prove too great? The answers to these questions will shape not just the future of AI, but the very fabric of global technology. If you have made it this far in the video, Comment with the word AI to let us know you're with us in exploring these groundbreaking developments. To stay relevant in the rapidly evolving age of AI, be sure to check out more videos from our channel.
Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.